Meanwhile, scientific studies and regulatory oversight are what keeps medicine from becoming potential death pills. Trials are conducted to find out how effective a new drug is and what the potential side effects are. But what happens when the data in a study turns out to be faulty? Our story right now is about Riva Roxaben, which is a blood thinner sold under the brand name Zalreto. In 2009, a study about it was published in the UK medical journal, The Lancet. Thirteen years later, The Lancet revisited the study called Record 4. Here's what they said. We learned that adverse events and serious adverse events had been underreported at the 9.9% of sites audited for Record 4. The study's publisher also apologized for the previous article and said, We are disappointed to learn this information, particularly at this late date. And it is most important that the medical community be informed of the inaccuracies. Riva Roxabin is a common blood thinner that has been in the market for years. The U.S. Food and Drug Administration has rejected the record for study, but went ahead and approved the drug for commercial use in 2011. It was approved in the United Kingdom in 2011 as well. We must add that the inaccurate record for study focused on using the drug to prevent blood clots after knee surgeries. The drug is used to prevent strokes as well. Over the years, the drug has seen its share of controversy. Multiple lawsuits had been filed in the U.S. against it. The companies which jointly developed the drug under the brand Plaintiff said that some patients had died due to uncontrollable bleeding after taking the drugs. Both companies agreed to settle most lawsuits in 2019 and paid about $775 million. But under the settlement agreement, the firms did not accept liability and stood by the drug's safety.